Hey everybody, it's LP Alusa. Welcome back to another part of Super Mario Bros. 3. My name is Silver Sleet, and in the last episode, we took on World 2. Pretty victorious, actually. Except for that one fill, which we never speak of. Anyways, third world, Aqua World, my probably worst world. Let's see what this will bring us. And you're kicking off the world, like, in style, because you're gonna start off in an Aqua World, and there is a little item upgrade here if I can even hit it. Cause that would be convenient. Mushroom, get here! Okay, thank you. Now I can go up all the way and actually proceed the level it was supposed to be. Now for this one, um, it's actually really difficult to take on enemies which are above you and that was a stupid play on my part. But yeah, you gotta be careful with this. You can rush through pretty quickly as I'm trying to do here, as you can see. I could just... Oh, Mushroom. Mushroom! No! Get here! Mushroom! Why'd you go the other way? Please come back, thank you. Okay, that's better. Watch out for those little red balls of justice. They will hurt you. I don't even know. Okay, gonna dodge the, um, dodge the bloopers. And up there is the exit of the first level. So that was pretty decent. And let's see, which card will I take? I will take a Mushroom. Mushroom. I will take a Mushroom. Da -da -da. Good. Next world. World 2. Or actually part 2. Level 2. Whatever you want to call it. I'll call it level 2. And God damn it. I wish there was like one recording where cars would not interrupt me like that. But they do. Um, wow, that was kind of weird. I kind of glitched there. And now I can shoot fireballs at them fishies. There is a one up there I believe, but it's kind of a pain to get so I won't. You can burn these fishes. Like that. Pretty um... Pretty non-dangerous, I would say. You can even jump on them, as I just showed twice. There is... Ooh, I'd rather not recommend you to go down there. Why did my controller not cooperate? I said go to the... Really? Really? Game... Game leave me out of here! God, that was stupid. Okay, now I gotta be careful. For Christ's sake. That was so dumb. Like, for real, I got trapped there, and I was like... Well, screw you. Okay. Whew, at least I made it. Watch out for the flying fishes. You're not there yet because that would be sore. And I get my second mushroom. Now to hope I actually um get the first one and actually get myself two lives. That would be convenient. And there is an item on the left or an item house. Let's see what we'll get. Big box. It's contents. We'll help you on your way. I get a frog suit again. My second frog suit. Let's see what the world all brings us. Let's go. I might make two uh, two episodes of World 3 since it's a kind of large world. Is this the one with the big fish? Yeah, it's the one with the gnawing fish. If you eat you, you're screwed. Like, done. Like, it's as simple as that. Ooh, I almost. Torture myself there, and that's not gonna work, is it? Yeah, of course it won't. Then I just got eaten. That kind of sucks. Well, at least I know not to do that again. Om nom nom. Mario Deaths 1. In this level. I'm not gonna, uh, gunny, really. I'm not gonna count the other ones in the last world. So, let's just go on. I can use the Cooper Shell to take out the big fish, but nah, I'm not really gonna be bothered. Okay, that one stopped right at the correct time. Now, for this one, there is a mushroom here, which obviously falls off the edge, and there is this block which you can use to kill the fish if you want. But the block kind of boosts, so that's Pretty pointless to me, and there I almost died, and god damn it, get this fish off me, thank you very much. God, that was nerve wracking. And please tell me I'm there. Damn, why are you so nerve? And I got myself the third mushroom, which is actually the first fireworks one up, or in this case, two up card, which I get at the end of the game, which proves that that could have gone better. Actually, that just sucked. Oh, castle with Mini Mario. That's gonna be interesting. Uh, oh god, lights. Disco lights. Disco lights of justice. I believe, actually, the one, there are doors here. I'm gonna take the fifth door, if I'm not mistaken. Second, third, gonna venture that, fourth, fifth. Am I correct? No, I'm not, but at least I get myself a one up. Which helps. I kinda... whoa... I kinda need this one, don't I? Six. Yep, six one is the correct one. Which makes this castle kinda short if you know which door it is. Either the fifth or the sixth is actually quite mistaken. Anyways, 
Now for big spiky guy with wings, which will go down just as easy as the others will. They'll make it a little bit more interesting by adding obstacles in the way, like later. Like in midair or like on the floor. It's kinda meh. It's not even that difficult. Anyways, if you got a hammer or if you will get a hammer, save it. You will not use it for that one down there. But what we will do is try to get ourselves a star. And this time a star. Can I please have a star? Yes I can! That gives me five lives. I like that. That is really good. And there we go. 23 lives. I'm still trying to pronounce my THs. Maybe I suck. I don't even know. Okay, for this one I believe it's in water, so I'm gonna go with a big mushroom bit of big mushroom here. Yeah. Cause yeah, this is kinda of difficult maneuvering and that was not a wrong choice, but I got fucked. As simple as that. Death count too. And he will go away, so I have no choice but to attack on World 4. World 4 is kind of surprisingly dry, I should say. There is not really a lot of water. There is water though, like here. And there is a piranha which tries to burn you. But that should be no problem, and especially after you get this, you should be fine. No, you... Why did that stop? That was kind of awkward. You can make this, but you can um, make yourself a... My controller is extremely pissing me off right now. It's not really letting me do what I want to do. Fuck that. Uh, retry. Retry. Because if you're small, you can have a lot of trolls here, and that's what you don't want. Okay, now for this one to go up, please. Die, thank you. And what does it give me? It gives me the hammer, which I mentioned in a few seconds ago, which... Oh. Ignore that failure. Once again, do not save it for the bottom left for the um, spades level. You're gonna need it for later. Let's do this right, this time. Oh, oh god, oh god, oh, whoa. Mm. Yes, yes, give me that, give me that, thank you very much. This time, cooperate, please, thank you. That was the worst jump ever, but at least I can get myself up there. Now we can go on. Once again, like, this is really bugging me for some reason. I believe there is a um, bot block down here, or a B switch, I should say. Oh, fire lava. I want that. I want that and I'm gonna run. I'm gonna run. I'm gonna run. In the sky with that little Likido creature, whatever it is. I'm gonna run and I'm gonna get myself the star, which is in this case a fire flower because I suck. <coughs> Ignore that. <laughs> that was obviously not what I wanted to do. Hey, memory card. Awesome. Probably every time I restart, I need to clear it again, so it's kind of fucked. Anyways, there are two stars here, because I... Almost every single time. There's a mushroom here, which is not there. And the fire flower... was up here. Um, god. The one-up is there? No, it's not. At least there are two mushrooms there, and... Boom. Now this one is kind of black for now, so we gotta do that later. Let's go to world 5. Another aqua world. This one's actually more difficult, so be careful with it. You will get zapped if you don't know what you're doing. You can you can like um, take care of this fish really easy. Please do so if you can, it will eat you and want to kill you regardless of which state you are. It's like, if you don't kill a fish and swim straight into it, it's like you're just jumping in a cliff. And yeah, that's not good. You can kill, still kill fishes with fire flowers though, so that's good. And there is a random one up there which I'm just gonna let go since there's not really a lot of chance I could have gotten it and that was kinda stupid. And now I gotta be careful with the big fish again. It actually spits out babies, that's kinda disgusting. And there was a green chip chip chasing me. Okay, no, not to get screwed over. Please do not get screwed over. Please do not get screwed over. Now I can starve for some fucking reason. Wow. I figured what I did wrong in the last part, but I can't. I really don't know. Okay, now, after you clear a level, it will, um... Drop the bridge and we can get ourselves the... Item box here, the contents will help you on your way. Now we'll go for a fire flower. Seems legit. Totally seems legit. <clears throat> Anyways, if you go to the other side, it reveals the second half of the game. And this is why I told everybody so far to save the hammer. You can actually go here, and we're gonna go for a little boat trip. 
and there are actually four upgrades which you can get. So if you're playing this in multiplayer, be sure you're the one who gets this. It helps. At least it potentially helps. So I am gonna try to set another star here. I hope I'm lucky. Please tell me I am. Yes, I am. That's 26 lives for me, Mario. I like that a lot. Okay, let's just go on. Now there is a item house here. What item did it get? It's kind of spooky and ray, probably something boring. Hmm, a fire flower. I can live with that. I can live perfectly fine with that, to be honest. I'm gonna go to this one, see if I can get myself another five lives that would be convenient. Let's see, one. And. Ooh, I was lucky there. Please tell me I'm again. Five lives, please. Thank you very much. Yes! I just got myself 15 lives with this game in this episode. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. For sure. Okay, for the last item on. Um, item house here, mushroom house, whatever you can call it. Pick your box, it's contest will help you on your way. Another fire flower, and I get in the mid air. Isn't that fucking fantastic? Or fan fucking tastic. No, you're not just done yet. If you go to here, there's actually another secret item house here. This is the last one though. Going all the way to the right shows the castle, but doesn't really do anything else. And it's council once again helping your way, and this is a leaf. Ain't that amazing. Okay, now we can go back and go and tackle on some levels again, like we should do. Once again, if this takes too long, I might split it into episodes, so you will see this episode now and the other one next week, or I might just upload them straight after each other. Anyways, on going with World 6, which is another, like, um, side-scrolling level, so we gotta, like, be careful with that, and for some reason it feels like my screen is laggy, and god damn you, Mushroom, why'd you go the other way? Why did you do that? I didn't want to, and that, ooh, that was fucking risky. I almost killed myself there. Um... Tip, if you want some item, go here, just be careful with this, and that was only a coin. It's not an item, you stupid idiot. I'm gonna see if I can do that again, with whatever is in here, and there is my item. A mushroom. And I can go up here. God, it's kinda... Yeah, I hate side scrolling levels, as you know. It's kinda waiting for the right moment, and in some cases it's actually really difficult, so... Like this, you know, if I would have jumped a little second earlier, I would have just spawned straight into that guy. Will this work? Probably not. And it drops a piece switch, which I'm not gonna get. It makes these coins. And that is goddamn risky. And there's nothing in there either, so it's kind of a waste. I'm just gonna go on with the lie. Level the way I want to. Watch out for this because your exit is down there, and if you get knocked off, you're just gone. Watch out for the green guy, and we will get ourselves a failure with a fire flower. At least it's another life, which is pretty good. Which makes our grand total like 17 or 18 lives in this episode. God, that's a lot of lives. That is a lot of lives, and we get more hammer bros, which if you do it right shouldn't be too much of a problem, but watch out for the hammers, as they're hammer bros for a goddamn reason. And these give you a star. Isn't that great? Okay. I could have easily gone to World 8 earlier, but I decided not to. I'm gonna go to here. And here we get a random leaf upgrade. And these guys, which are surprisingly annoying, I believe they spawn spike balls in your head and that hurts. So be careful with these guys. And be careful with the timing of your peace switch. There's actually something up there, but let's not force it. I cannot see what's down there, so I gotta be careful. See, these things should... Whatever they have on you, and ow, that's hurts. Oh wow, I'm already there. God damn it, I'm lucky, and I got a star. Yes! Yay for stars. Oh yeah. So it's going pretty good so far. I'm pretty much gonna jinx myself now. I'm gonna go to the castle. Welcome to the castle. Which is underwater. Isn't that amazing? An underwater castle. Are you fucking kidding me? And there are disco lights underwater. Disco fever continues underwater. And there are fish here, which makes sense. 
since it's underwater, be careful for this fish, and you get a flower for it, which means you can burn fish. I said flora, it's a flower. Forget my worse. Forget my bad English. God, I'm sucking. Okay, where are we now? Now there are these little weird things here, and those things are annoying. Actually, look at that. That just hit me twice, and one more hit, and I'm screwed. I hate this part right here. I really do. And now you gotta maneuver correctly between. Be careful, you don't want to die. And go here. Now, if you thought you were there, obviously you're not. Since you still got the spike guy, and this is what kind of what I mean with obstacles half way. You know, you can like hit your head, get stuck here into this guy, and you're screwed. But in this case, I'm safe, which is whew, I'm glad so. Okay, next. This kind of unlocks something, but I'm pretty sure it's a dead end. So we gotta go on. Uh, I'm gonna get myself. God damn it, don't tell me it's true. Don't tell me it's true. Don't tell me I'm gonna get 20? 20, 20? Yes! Another 5 lives! I'm gonna go up to 37 Mario's. Like, god damn! I was at 13 when I started, so I'm 13 to 37. It's kinda late, you know? 1, 3, 37? Huh? huh? No. I know, it's not funny. Okay. Hey, it's the big fish. Uh, gotta be careful with the big fish. Gotta be careful with the big f oh. LOL, I just killed the big fish. But, yeah, it respawns. It has a spawn timer, and there it is again. Uh, what am I gonna do with this? I need that block. I wanna see if there's anything up here. Coins! God damn it, I don't need coins, but I'll take it. Oh, that was risky. That was goddamn risky. And ha, uh, that's also risky. And at least I can climb up here if I don't screw up too much. Which means that I am safe in terms of falling ground. Or sinking ground. Whatever you want to say. Let's go. That was also very risky. Ladies and gentlemen. That was weird. Okay, goddammit. I hate this level. Hurry! God damn it, sink faster! Or get up faster. That's what she says. How is it even possible that this fish swims through the rocks or whatever it swims through? It's kind of weird, isn't it? Um, is this my gateway to the exit? Yes, it is. My gateway to the exit, that sounds kind of double. Gonna run through this thing, gonna get my star, and I will get. Oh, that was almost a perfect symphony. And I got myself another star card, which is good. One more level and then the boss. I guess I'm doing pretty okay right now. But... That almost killed me. And that's just the beginning of this level, so be careful- Oh, this is the level with the random bullet bills in between. And the bombs! Oh god, bombs? I hate bombs. You gotta explode walls with this, I hate this one. I believe I actually have to go there. Uh, okay, I need that, I need that, I need that. Come on. Um, okay, that's good. That's good. Now I can go on. Let's see, is there anything there which I need? God damn it. Ah, really? Okay, um... Hey, one up. One up. Must have one up. Ow. That kind of screwed me over, didn't it? Did I just... Got myself a block with me? Yeah, I took a block with me. Because blocks are fucking awesome. And I kind of should go in there, shouldn't I? But god, there are two chip chips here. They're both green. So we gotta be a little bit careful with this. With this one. Um, yeah, should be fine now. I'm gonna go back up, and that will lead straight to the exit. Which means I'm gonna get myself a star. No, I won't. No, five lives. I will take one instead. I will go with it. Because I can. That kind of clears the whole world, and of course, it has to be in one up or a memory game in between. Screw it over. At least I know this time that these are equal. So that helps. Somehow. And I believe it's almost there. No, it's not. It's a mushroom. Please give me one up. Flop. I flower. Fuck. Ah, man. Whatever. It's not really important. Now, if you take this pipe and go out on the other side, which I kind of filled, they get here. At the castle. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give myself that mushroom which I got, since I like to go and protect it. 
That's what she said, and let's go. Oh, it's terrible! The king has been transformed! Please find the magic wand so we can change him back! I'm gonna keep that. Keep doing that. Every single time. Every single goddamn time, you better prepare for it. Prepare for my storm, my wrath, my anything, my what? What? Okay. Oh god, it's those guys again. The. Um, where's. Drawing go guys goes goes really ow I just got screwed over by this bullet bill I gotta go to the other side before I get fucked. Uh, that was really really stupid. Now at least we get to show what happens whenever we um fall. The ship will go and obviously you have to go back since like goddamn why did it go all the way there? That's pretty obvious since it needs a spot. And as you can see, the level is right here. So in that case, I'm gonna take fire flow. And let's go. That way, I have a little bit more of protection. Retry. Let's see what I've tried this time. I'm not gonna use too many items though. I'd like to keep it limited since in World Eight, I'm gonna need every single one of them. And I repeat, every single one of them. Oh God. Uh, God. 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 I really hate those. That one is so horribly placed, like it killed me last time, it hit me twice, so I gotta be careful not to do that again. And if you go here, there is actually an item here, but I already got a fire flower, I guess. Oh, whoa, what? The Nuki Leaf? Oh, that's interesting. Actually, you can try to go up there to save yourself the trouble which I just went through, and save yourself the power up which I just lost. And you got these things which you can use to go all the way to the other side, or at least avoid some obstacles. In some cases you actually need it, and in some cases you don't. So I'm just gonna go here since the end was here regardless. Okay, so far we're going good. So far we're going good. You can go up here and get more of these um, weird tossing dudes. You can like, they will constantly respawn, so I guess you can like entertain yourself with these guys for a bit. And there is the white pipe here which leads to the boss. Boss once again has these weird ass magic spells that actually cast rings and those rings hurts. As you just saw, and I'm kind of in a risky position here. I am in a risky position and I almost died there, so I'm really lucky that I got that. And that will conclude World 3, a 22 and a half minute long video so far, or maybe a little bit less. Anyways, I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, please leave a comment, add it to your favorites, and like the video. And of course, subscribe to LPLusa and or to my channel if you haven't done that already. And in the next episode, holy shit, that's Mario. He looks goddamn like Mario. Oh, thank heavens, I'm back to my old self again. Thank you so much. Here is a letter from the princess. Goddamn bro. We got a bro. Real bro. Greetings! The white black contains magic powers so that will enable you to defeat your enemies. I have a closer jewel that helps protect you. Princess Toadstool. Anyways! World 4 is the mini mega world, I would call it. It is like a world where you can get really big. Or obstacles actually get really big, which makes you really small. So, hope you're looking forward to that. Like I said, this was episode 3 of Super Mario Bros. 3. My name is Solosleet, and I will see you guys next time.